Yeah. What do I owe the pleasure today? <laughs> She's just like working on his own hand. That's so cool. Is that what the eyeball implant looks like? <laughs> no way. There's got to be some other guy. Slows time. Oh my god. If you could change your perception of time. Man, in a way that would be like immortality if you could like slow down your experience. Hey, I'm Jeff Carlson and I'm a robotics engineer. And today on Experts React, we're gonna be checking out Cyberpunk 2077. Let's see what it's like. All right, Cyberpunk, man, the hype around this game. I can't tell who's a robot and who's a person anymore. Is that the future? I'm part of titanium now, by the way. Am I a robot now? Oh, whoa. See, that's what I was thinking robots should have. It's like cool tech. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Reading her mind? So if a human gets a brain implant chip, will people be able to do that? Maybe they can do it with Bluetooth. They don't even have to plug in a wire. Found the shard. We're moving now. The shard. Check the biomass. Anything change? Anything change? Anything Just throws it on the ground. <laughs> Your premium plan will cover 90%. In the future, we figure out androids, but we don't figure out fair insurance. <laughs> What is that? Oh, it's like an EpiPen. Holy <laughs> it worked. What do I owe the pleasure today? <laughs> She's just like working on his own hand. That's so cool. Man, so are these humans with like robot upgrades? Or robots that look like humans? But if you could get a robot upgrade, would you do it? What if you could run really fast? <laughs> I know there's robots that do surgeries now. Do you feel safer with a human doctor or a robot doctor? There's a question you might have to ask someday. I mean, today. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. In hand? <laughs> He's got the robot hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Heartbeat looks good. Operating system, that's the weird one. I was like, okay, where's the robotic one? I'm running on human 2.0. That's pretty cool. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the tops of- Oh, that's cool. I've actually always kind of wanted something like that. Like, can you imagine if you have a contact lens that you can project things onto? That'd be so cool. Although, you know they would put ads on it. You're trying to like walk outside and suddenly a commercial starts playing in your peripheral vision. Now a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. This is 2077, but there are robot doctors already. Play by play though. Really doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. <laughs> That's not what you want your doctor to look like as he's coming to put you to sleep. You still got his sunglasses on. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Scanning people. That's pretty cool. Although, I wonder what exactly is scanning. <laughs> you got eyeball scanners. I think about your uh, elementary school teacher saying, you're not gonna have a calculator with you everywhere you go. It's like, I'm gonna have an eyeball scanner. Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Thank you, Victor. Didn't trust you at first when my doctor was the Fonzie, but you did all right. Wonder if people are gonna get really divided between those who get the upgrades and those who don't. So what do you want? Is that what the eyeball implant looks like? <laughs> no way. There's gotta be some other guy. Man, this game is so pretty. Yeah, I'll take a seat. <laughs> Man, they all have like scary eyes. Come on, gotta lighten up. Take a hit. Oh my gosh, I thought he was just going to go for it. He's doing robot drugs. Dynamic thermal optic camel bar bar. Ooh, oh no. <laughs> I'm so scared of stuff like this. Prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. There are already so many different versions of robot dogs. Watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings, Oh no, they climbed the walls. I don't like this. <laughs> He's so scary. First impression, oh cute, a little running robot. Second impression, that thing is probably faster than me. Maybe I do like it more when they look like humans. Got a couple of questions. Quick you answer. Quick will leave you to get back to your patients. 
What are you doing? Oh my goodness. What is going on? So is this robots living with humans? I don't think so. I think it's people getting upgrades. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. I know she oh my goodness. Is she awake right now? Yes, but I have a procedure. I'm yeah, <laughs> her face is wide open and full of metal. I can't wait. There, there, wipe away. Her eye? What about your mouth, dude? Want any short circuiting now, do we? None of the doctors are wearing gloves or anything. <laughs> I guess they're not really doctors, let's be honest. <laughs> There's some back alley mechanics. These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. Oh, uh, this guy sucks. Quack. Know that? Cyberware upgrades, here we go. How may I help you? for some new chrome. Of course. Get comfortable and we'll get to it. Want some new crow? Upgrade your skeleton, that'd be pretty cool. Slows time? Oh my god, if you could change your perception of time. Man, in a way that would be like immortality if you could like slow down your experience. I don't even know what's possible. I think the future is going to get weirder than we can possibly imagine. And this is such a cool game for talking about that. Blood pump? Legs, yeah, let's get some leg upgrades. Reinforced tendons and jump super high. I mean, as long as it was like safe, would you do that? Or would you get some upgrade like this? And I mean, if you're living in or experiencing a virtual world, I mean, this stuff is not even affecting your body. You'd be upgrading your virtual person. Immune system, hands. Oh my gosh, go for the robot fingers. That's so cool. It's worth it, you can get it. Tattoo? Oh, that's just what is equipped right now. That's kind of cute. He's like, you know what? I'm not going to do any upgrades right now. Man, I don't know. I mean, technically, I've got some upgrades. I broke some bones. I got some titanium parts. Is that really so different? Somebody from the past might look at that and be like, Cyberpunk 2022, you've got titanium bones now. It's going to be a weird future. So that's Cyberpunk 2077. I have a hunch that this body modification stuff is gonna be here a lot sooner than that. I mean, it kind of already is. It just really makes you think, would you do it? Would you get some kind of upgrade if it was safe and it was available? Don't go to those back alley doctors. I wonder if the world's ready for it. It's gonna be exciting though. You just have to wait and see. Thanks for watching, I'm Jeff Carlson. You can follow me at Jezero Creator on Instagram. See you next time. That was a little weird, but I'll try again. <laughs> And uh, thanks for checking in today. Oh, that was a weird thing to say. Um, <laughs> thanks for jacking in. Um,